Joining us right now is Wisconsin Attorney General Josh Call. Mr. Call, thank you so much for being with us this morning. I know it's a busy day. I want to get right to it. Your office is the, the lead on this investigation. It's an independent investigation into Jason, Jacob Blake's shooting. You released some new information this morning. Among that information, that the officer who fired the shots at Blake and a second officer on the scene first used their tasers on Blake. That didn't work. Why did they need to use their tasers when they got to the scene? Uh, the officers were attempting to effectuate an arrest and uh, they used their tasers in the course of that uh, process because they were trying to, to stop Mr. Blake. Uh, the, those, those tasers didn't work and um, Mr. Blake uh, ultimately was shot. So we also know that there was a knife that was found in Blake's car. Did the officers that responded to the scene know that there was a knife there prior to the shooting? We're not commenting on that detail at this point in the investigation. Mr. Blake uh, stated to investigators that he had a knife in his possession and there was one that was found on the driver's side floorboard. I, I got to push you on that, sir, because I know this is a question that you've refused to answer so far. Uh, it was your office that released this detail about the knife and many people would say that that disparages Blake in this story that we know so far. Why not tell the full story now? Uh, this is an ongoing investigation and we are not commenting on facts that may be disputed as this case moves forward. Ultimately, this case is going to be uh, presented after a full and thorough investigation to a prosecutor who's going to make a charging decision. And if there is uh, a charge or charges that are filed in this case, this is going to be tried in a court of law. And it's uh, our top priority to make sure we're protecting the integrity of this investigation. What happened on the scene there is something that the entire country is watching right now. This video seen by so many and, and it's at the heart of the protests that we're seeing in your state right now. Uh, an officer holding Blake's shirt when he opens fire and shoots him in the back. How does that happen? Well, that's part of what this investigation is about is uh, conducting a full and thorough investigation into the facts of this case. So we have this complete an understanding as possible of what led to those events so that a charging decision that's based on the facts and the law can be made. And if this case does go to before a jury, that the jury has a full and complete picture of the facts. Are the officers cooperating with the investigation right now? Yes, there has been cooperation uh, with this investigation. The investigation is moving forward briskly. There have been uh, several material witness interviews conducted, um, but the investigation continues to move forward. And how transparent are you going to be? We're going to continue providing the public with the information that we can, consistent with the integrity of the investigation. Attorney General Call, we thank you for your time again this morning. Thanks for having me. Still very much an active investigation, but so many questions this morning. Yeah, not many answers yeah. yet. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.